Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video, we will determine if vegetable oil is polar or non-polar in nature. Now to answer this question, let us dive into its composition first and then we will have a look at its structure. Now vegetable oil consists of molecules known as triglycerides. Now triglycerides are nothing but esters formed by reaction between three units of fatty acid and glycerol. In this reaction, you can clearly see how three long chain of carbon atoms that has come from fats, it's attached to the glycerol molecule here to make one molecule of vegetable oil. So this is the structure of vegetable oil and it is divided into two parts. That is first is fatty acid part that has uh, 14 or more carbon atoms and it is hydrophobic in nature. And that is because of carbon and hydrogen part of this chain and the glycerol gly, glycerol part that is slightly hydrophilic in nature so each triglyceride molecule has hydrophilic part that is water attracting portion but as you see here it has relatively large hydrophobic portion of long chain fatty acids now that makes the hydrophilic portion tough for water molecules to interact with the hydrophilic portion of triglyceride molecule so sugar, let us take an example of sugar that why does it, you know, dissolve so quickly in water. Now sugar gets completely dissolved in water and that is because it has many polar hydroxyl group. Now these hydroxyl group interacts with water which is also a very polar solvent and you know and forms hydrogen bonds. So there are many sites available in, in the case of sugar molecule with which water interacts and form hydrogen bond. But in the case of vegetable oil, even though there is a dipole moment in the case of ester moiety, it is not enough to make dipole-dipole hydrogen bonds with water uh, that we saw in the case of sugar. There are, uh, you, but even though there are weak interaction like van der Waal forces, but uh, these are not enough to induce polarity in the whole triglyceride molecule. So, the hydrophobic part of the oil outweighs the slight polarity that it has and uh, we can say that vegetable oil is non-polar in nature. So this is what oil looks like when poured in water and the reason being the non-polarity of oil. For more such videos, make sure to subscribe our channel and thank you for watching.